Hello and welcome to part 4 of Sonic Mania. I've finally been able to do commentary on my Sonic Mania playthrough since it's on the PS4 so it's kind of different. So I hope you enjoy and I hope you remember to comment, like and subscribe. So anyway. Crush Garden, um, it's not really one of my favourites, but it's not one of my least favourites either, so it gets an approval from me, but the Act 2 boss does kind of annoy me, since I can't really do it without Supersonic, since I always just end up dying, so yeah, that's, that's a bummer, but Act 1 is pretty easy, so should be a breeze. Also, let me know if you like my bio videos that I did, and also if you're enjoying my two playthroughs, Mario and Sonic at the Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games, and my Sonic Mania playthrough. Anyway, I do like the ideas in this level, bouncing off the rope, those, those platforms that are out of the wall, and even how you have those spinning things. It's just really cool what they did with this level. But you know sometimes those platforms can be a pain and wow I almost just fell all the way to the bottom. Okay. Let's go! Oh oops. wait actually I'll yeah. just come this way. Okay. Drop dash! But yeah, also, now I can actually talk about this game since I'm finally getting off my lazy bus and doing commentary. So, I do, I do really like how they added the drop dash to this game. It just really helps you get that burst of speed. You know, you don't always have to stop for a spin, if you know what I mean. But, anyway, got it. Well, this is what I was talking about with the blocks being annoying. Oh, come on! Anyway, yeah. like when you need that burst of speed, the drop dash is just waiting for you. And then, and also, you know, unlike the peel out and the spin dash, you don't have to stay still. You can just keep on going. But if you're or if you're already standing still, then you might as well do a spin dash. Since just jumping for a drop for drop dash sake, yeah, kind of not worth it. Speed up. No, no, uh, oh. Yeah, I always, I always like to go on the top path. Yeah, okay, then I can get the fire shield which helps me in the next round. Oh, come on. Take a switch. Boing yeet. Oh, yeah. Come up here. Oh, yeah, you also get an achievement for coming here if you play on the PS, if you're playing on the PS4. And probably the same way. Xbox, but I don't know how that works. Oh yeah, make sure you hit the top blocks first, because I think the bottom one... Yeah, it's not going to end well. And then, if, if David can actually do it right, he will receive an extra life. Okay. I guess the game just said, one day, Trinities aren't allowed to keep their shields. And just smash that X, bu X button like you've never before. Drop it. And it's time to spin anyway. Oh, come on, just let him drop. Let's go. Luckily, when there's a loop or something, or when you go upside down, instead of holding the direction if you don't know where to go, you just start rolling and it'll do it for you. Unless you're playing a different kind of Sonic game, since the 3D Sonic games, um, rolling doesn't increase your speed, which is weird. Anyway, I've showcased the zone, and now it's time to go Super Sonic style on it. And just like that, the Soul Blades were no more. Oh yeah. He died, now we can celebrate.
Sonic got to act one. Sweet. Ooh, look at snowing. And now it's time for act two. I feel like this is one of the this is one of the few zones that act one and act two look nothing the same. Like even for the preview of Act 1, I mean, the preview of Press Garden, you just see Act 2, which looks nothing like Act 1. So, yeah. Act 2 is all snowy and stuff, while Act 1 kind of looks like in, uh, I guess a factory. But, yeah. I, mean, I guess the same thing can be said for, um... Actually, I think... Oh, yeah, Marsh Moon then, but... Apart from those two zones, all the zones basically look the same, the Act 1 and 2. Oh yeah, actually, Flying Battery, which I just did in my recent video. That, the Act 1 and Act 2 are kind of different since Act 2 is all stormy, whilst Act 1 is just nice blue clear skies. Wait, yeah, yeah, blue clear. No, clear blue skies. Oops. Look, no, no, at me in the comments for that. Okay, watch the spikes. Watch the spikes. Oh, come on. What's supposed to show off if I can't show? Okay, anyway, coming to the big ring. Now, all you need to do is just abuse the power of flight with your boy Tails. And then you get up here. Break, 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 spring through, voila! Fire shoot! Well, I'll never see you again! Okay. And now, we can break ice like it's our job. You know, you can do that because of two. Pun intended. And then you can do this because we're hot. Let me see. Nah, yeah, that one there like that. Invincibility! Oh, there's nothing here. Sales! How dare you! Okay, sorry, that, that, I didn't say that, like, say it like that. Look. Let me know what your favorite zone is. For me, my favorite zone is Metallic Madness Zone. Like, even though the original version of Sonic CD wasn't, wasn't that good, it could just get lost. But Act 2, I mean, but in this game, they made it, they just made it really fun. Like, the music's so cool. Act 1, you go in the background. And Act 2, you turn into TV Sonic. Like, who really knew what they were doing? But then Sonic Forces came along with it. Yeah. So, now it's time for my least favorite boss in the game. And just gonna get a few hits before I turn super. Looks like you just allow me. Oh, thanks, Tails. Wow, that was actually the quickest boss fight ever. Now. I think we should have time for Starter Speedway, so let's go. I mean, let's do this. Oh, there's Dr. Robotnik, and looks like he's trying to do that thing again with the little planet. And also, that was Metasonic. Let's let's go. Oh, this is definitely my second. My second favorite zone in the game. Just like Metallic Madness Zone, the music is too good. You can say it's way past cool, if you know what I mean. But anyway, start a speedway. Here we go. Ding, 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 ding. Go under, go over. Right, another reason why I got that is too good. Why need to stop and spin when you can just jump, drop, and roll? 
Oh yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Another thing that's good about this game, which I actually haven't really started talking about, is that it's not like the first Sonic game where some of the levels were actually not some of the levels, all of the levels apart from my favourite Starlight Speedway, I mean Starlight Zone and uh Minho Zone. All of, apart from those two, all of the zones were pretty slow. Especially Labyrinth Trend. Actually especially all of them, really. Apart from I guess I can let, um, uh, what's the last zone called, um, ah, uh, darn it, I forgot, I don't really play it, I forgot the name, but, anyway, the last zone, that one's not too slow, I mean, unless you, unless you die a lot, uh, 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 what was the name of it, ah, uh, I'll, I'll probably remember it later, but, uh, yeah, and, like, Lots of speed sections in this level, as well as in um, Mirage Saloon, which is my third favorite zone. Yeah. We'll come on to that soon. Okay, there's the spikes. And another really cool thing is just how, like, if you're struggling, just, just use tails. Oh, I thought I missed it. Ow! Nah, oh, darn it. See? I was struggling. I mean, not really, I just made a mistake, but now I can just mash that X button with the power of Tails, and then jump up there, Oh, get the drop dash, that's what I'd like to see. And let me know what your favorite Sonic game is, because I remember, I remember in the Sonic Mania Plus advert, they were saying how this game was the best game ever, but Someone was just telling me that my favorite Sonic game that I've played is Sonic Colors. I mean, the music was great, the zones were really original, and they were really the game was really colorful. I mean, I know they call it Sonic Colors, but I think that's because of the Wisps. But, and also, Planet Wisps, oh my days, that was too good. And also, um, Resort, tropical resort, yeah. And you're not getting away. <sighs> Thanks for that, Tails. Sonic got through Act One again. I mean, not really, because it's a different game. <sighs> and now, one of the best parts of the game: destroy the factory and heading for the future. I guess Classic Sonic must have went to the bad future since he ends up in Sonic Forces. Yeah. I think I just made the best Sonic joke possible. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey. Hey. Let's go. Dun, 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 dun. Oh boy. No, I don't like coming down here. Okay, hopefully. Come on. What the fuck is going to I'm going to move. I'm going to move. Uh, okay. Out of my way. Let's go. Wow, I did all of that work just to go back down again. Oh, recently when I've been playing this zone, I keep going down. I need, I need to step it up. Uh, I said, I need to step it up. Act 2 music is too good. The game's music in general is just so good. That, that's not even allowed. I I got hit by nothing. By nothing. Like, if you know what that was, you need to tell me, because I got hit by nothing for all I know. I got hit by no no, no Sonic is invincible. How, how dare you like the Lord of Physics? Ooh, touching the ground there! Speed, 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 speed! Ooh, supersonic 50 rings! Let's go!